it's the eye. Hey, what's up everybody? It's your boy back with y'all and I thought I would talk to y'all about today's video. I just finished watching the Ghostbusters teaser trailer. A lot of rumors out there that it's real and a lot of rumors out there that it's fake. Now, I'm going to break it down for y'all. As you can see, it's clearly playing here on the screen and it's a barn. Cameras panning up to it. Uh, we see the proton packs going off. We see Ecto-1 being revealed in 2020, the year. <clears throat> now, I'm going to break down this trailer and tell you my thoughts and theories on what's truly going on in the Ghostbuster universe. Um, let's back it up a little bit. It's going to be 30 years uh, have went by. Um, Egon has passed away first. That's going to be probably told in a backstory somehow. Ray was uh, able to keep his parents' house, which I think this is the barn next door to the house. Uh, Ghostbusters have closed up shop. Um, Egon passing away mysteriously. Never solved, probably. Um, Dan Aykroyd's character, Ray, lives at his parents' house that he was able to save from the first movie because you know he put it up for mortgage or lease or whatever it was. He put it up as collateral to fund the Ghostbusters uh, job. So it's 30 years later. Uh, Ray lives out there. He took Ecto and all the equipment home. They closed up the firehouse. Winston went off and did his thing. Uh, Janine and um, Sully, or well, Holly, I can't even think of his name, uh, did their thing. And. Um, Bankman did his thing with Sigourney Weaver's character. So, Ray lives at home at, at the parents' house. Everything's in the, the barn. That's the scene that you're seeing in the trailer. Uh, they're all eating dinner. Ray's kids, probably older, are in town visiting for maybe a holiday or something. And on the, on the TV, uh, a news report comes over uh, stating that Bankman has passed away mysteriously. So, at the same time, uh, Winston is calling Ray on the phone and to turn on the news. And he tells him, I already saw it. Uh, you know, the family's concerned. Ray's family's concerned. They're all concerned. What is going on? Why is Vankman now gone? Because, as we all know, Bill Murray has always said that he would love to play a ghost. And this is probably the best way and opportunity to do it. Uh, Winston tells Vank, uh, Ray, you know, something's going on. I'm going to come see you. So we get the scene from the trailer. Uh, you know, everybody goes to bed that night. They hang up. The scenes go on. I think this is probably what's going to probably... It would make this is what I would want. Uh, you get the scene where the um, car, uh, the cameras going up to the barn. You see the proton pack going off, and um, it wakes up. It wakes up Ray, and possibly his son or daughter or whoever is going to be there, or whatever is going on, and startles them. And we end up finding out the proton packs are actually being discharged. Possibly by Vankman, and Vankman actually found Ray and came to the barn to get his attention without waking up the family. But we also see that Vankman has a nuisance with him, and it's it's Slimer. Slimer and Vankman are constantly battling each other. They knock over a proton pack, goes off, knocks the the tarp off the car. Ray comes out and is startled to see Vankman and Vankman tells him 
there's something wrong in the ghost world. And that right there sets up the movie. Winston shows up. Uh, Janine and... So, uh, golly, I can't even think of... What's his name's character's name? Show up. Everybody comes back together. Sigourney Weaver shows up. Everybody's trying to figure out what happened to Vankman and possibly Egon. And from there, that that's Ghostbusters 3. That's this is this movie. This is what I think could possibly happen. This is possibly the plot and the base foundation of Ghostbusters 3, as in Bankman dies mysteriously, Ray and Winston have to come together, reform the team with their siblings or other people to figure out what happened to their friend that is now a ghost that is visiting them and the barn, uh, re-stirring up the, the ghost world and ghosts start coming back out because they haven't done anything in so long that everybody just has to come back together and there's our movie that's what i gathered from this trailer i think in the long run that if any of this is done like what i was talking about you know the way i saw from what i got in this teaser I'm happy. I, I'm stoked. I can't wait to see a digital Venkman. You know, uh, don't overdo the CGI on him. Leave it a little practical and a little CGI. Make him interact like he, he was still there, but not there in the physical. You know, have him and Slimer butting heads the whole time in the movie, <coughs> uh, him butting heads with Ray and make it like if he was still alive. I think that this is great all the way around. I think what I'm talking about would make a great movie because I am a Ghostbuster fan. I have talked to my buddy about this as of today when this came out. The trailer came out this morning. Uh, all the uh, signs point to that it's real and i mean i am stoked people i am fight i'm happy i can't wait i just want what i'm talking about to come to life and possibly be true from what i what i'm saying <sighs> you know it could even be um Sigourney weaver's character coming and bringing one of the ki uh bringing the little boy as an adult and he's part of the team. Even, um, I can't even think of his name. Uh, Janine and, and the, God, they have a kid. Everybody's got their own offspring and they all come together and do the whole thing. I think that would be great. Now, they're going to probably turn to the book, uh, Tobin's Spirit Guide. And possibly try to figure out who the villain is. Or if they're even going to draw a villain from there. Or it could possibly be uh, to save the world. They have to do something. I think this is going to go probably go way beyond New York. And, and, and reach out maybe over the United States. Or maybe overseas. And they have to do something. But let me know what you think of my theory on the Ghostbusters trailer movie and I'm happy let me know what you think down below in the comment section I hope you all enjoyed today's video it is what it is it's only a theory people but it's my theory peace y'all